the old cliche, diamonds are a girl's best friend, but this next story proves that men get just as giddy when they find a shiny rock. KERK Force Melissa Simas joins us now with more on the latest find at the Crater of Diamonds State Park in Murfreesboro. Good Hello. Good how are you? Real good. Uh, I found something here and I wondered <laughs> if you could identify it for me. Oh my. Glenn Worthington is smiling from ear to ear and he has reason to be. Oh. Well, I think you got a diamond here. Um, yep, it's all um, nicely faceted uh -huh. and real pretty. The brown beauty he's decided to call brown rice is not Mr. Worthington's first find at the Crater of Diamond State Park in Murfreesboro. He has been digging at the park since 1978. I'm not really in it for the money. And since then, he's accumulated quite a collection, from this heart-shaped white diamond to the first yellow diamond he found nearly 32 years ago. Some of them he has chosen to sell as souvenirs to tourists who never strike it big at the park. USA diamonds are among the rarest in the world. It's an incredible place, the only place in the world where you can keep the diamonds you find. So what's his secret? Look for gravel. Uh, diamonds are a, a mineral that are found in with other gravel. I'd say check drains and ditches for gravel. And uh, when you dig it up, if it's not gritty sounding or if it doesn't feel like there's gravel in it, throw it out if it's just silt. You forget about the 300 buckets with nothing in it if you can find three diamonds in 10 buckets. Back inside. Come on in. Okay. All the work comes down to this. The moment of truth, it's a 2.136, which we count as a 2.1. And jackpot. Brown rice is the largest diamond Mr. Worthington has ever found and it sets another record. It is like a touchdown at the Super Bowl moment. All right, thank you. Certification. Very good. Congratulations, Two, one, three. our largest diamond this year. Thank you very much, Justin, I appreciate it. And just maybe, so will his wife. And there are three types of diamonds that you can find at the state park. 60% are white, 21% brown, and 17% yellow. Mr. Worthington, Worthington has also written a book, and he has put together a DVD showing people how to find diamonds. Back to you guys. Amazing. Something so little can be worth so much. It can be found.